Hi everyone, it's Mark Barnes here and today I've been lucky enough to get my hands on the Op6 librarian software. So today I'm going to do a quick tutorial on how to back up your patches and save the work that you've been doing in this wonderful little synth and also how to install third party presets into the Op6. So first of all, we need to connect our OP6 to our PC or Mac using a USB cable. I'm using a Mac. I hope it's not too different on a PC. And when you load it up, the first thing you see on the screen is this receive all data. I would hit OK at this point, And you'll see factory presets are now on the screen. When I scroll down below 250, you can see the presets I've done are there on the screen too. Now, before installing any third party presets, I strongly recommend that you make a backup of your own preset. And I'm going to show you how to do that. So we go to File. We go Save Library. We type in a name. So I've done this earlier and I just called it Mark Barnes Library 28th of January 2021, which is today. And then you hit Save. It's asking me if I want to replace. That won't come up for you, but I'll just replace the earlier library that I saved. At that point, you've made a backup of everything that's currently in your OP6, and you can recall it at any time. Okay, next I'm going to show you how to load in third-party presets. Okay. So if we go to File and Merge Library, I'm going to be soon selling a bank of presets called Mark Barnes Presets 1 to 32. And this is the file that will be provided. Mark Barnes Presets 1 to 32. So I'm going to click on that and hit Open. You'll see now that my preset bank is on the left hand side of the screen and the current library in your OP6 will be on the right hand side of the screen. Now say if I want to load this bank of presets to say position 400 and onwards, I'll click on position 400, I'll then go to the left hand side of the screen click on first pad, hold shift and click the very bottom preset which is at number 34. All I need to do then is drag this over to the right hand side of the screen and you can see it's going green. So I'm going to move it to position 400 and then I'm going to let go of my mouse. We're nearly done. We then hit Merge. Okay, now if I scroll down to preset number 400, you'll see now that my presets are now loaded in at pre preset 400 and onwards. There's one last step. When it's, where it says Programs, we're going to hit Send All. And it says that this will overwrite the data in your op 6. We want to continue. We've done a backup anyway if something goes wrong. And we'll hit OK. This spins for a few seconds. That's OK. So loading it into your op 6. When it goes away, that's it done. So just as a check, I'm going to receive all programs from my op6 so hit receive 
and if I scroll down, we'll see that my latest bank of patches is now at preset 400 and onwards. I hope this is a help to you. Thanks for watching and please consider my latest bank of patches for the wonderful Korg Op 6. Thank you very much.